Can I ask you specifically about the content of that statement? It's covered in, in uh, paragraph 7 of your, your witness statement. The officer asked you, one of the voices, this is of the, the um, two or perhaps three people you saw leaving um, by the side gate, mm -hmm. could have been a woman's voice, and you replied that it could have been, but you couldn't say either way. Um, precisely, um, <clears throat> because the event had been so comparatively unremarkable and unworthy of note at the time that I hadn't paid that degree of attention to it. When you say the police have since confirmed to you that the fact you gave a supplementary statement raised their suspicions in relation to you, uh, first of all, when did they give you that confirmation, can you recall? Um, this was um, at the time that I was arrested. And what was it about the supplementary statement you gave, or the fact that you gave it, which raised their suspicions? Uh, well, quite. I mean, it um, came as a considerable surprise to me that they thought that this was a matter um, to arouse suspicion, given the fact that they had um, emphasised that supplementary statements would be welcomed. Um, I think they um, felt that um, I had perhaps been attempting to deflect um, any attention from my own potential involvement. And you, you say at the end of paragraph 7, on the basis of what ensued, you believe it's likely that the police pass these suspicions on to the media, because we can move um, the story forward to Wednesday the 29th of December. In your own words, please, Mr Jeffries, what, what happened on that date? Uh, well, Wednesday the 29th of December is certainly a key date, um, because <laughs> until then... Um, I had not been the subject of any particular media attention, um, but that suddenly changed. Um, a Sky News team were extremely anxious to talk to me. Um, a large number of reporters and photographers appeared at the address where I lived. Um, they had somehow got to hear about the content of that second witness statement. Uh, they had got a hold of a very garbled edition um, of it, um, and they were extremely anxious to know uh, whether I believed I had seen Joe Yates leaving the premises um, on the 7th, 17th of December in the company of... Um, one or more other people. Because uh, to, be, to be clear, Mr Jeffries, your supplementary statement said that, in answer to the question that was uh, put to you, uh, that one of the voices could have been a woman's voice. You mm -hmm. couldn't say either way, but you certainly weren't identifying anyone. Is that right? Well, that's right. But it that's came right. back to you, mediated mm -hmm. through uh, the media, as it were, that... Your supplementary statement that, that said... I, I had actually been a witness to Joe Yates leaving the premises in company with a person or other people. You never said anything along those lines Absolutely. To, the, to the police? Absolutely, yeah. yeah.